test. A flu shutdown. The response tonight from a local campus closing their doors due to too many sick students and teachers. Tonight, Austin Travis County health officials say another flu death has the total now raised at 24 for this season so far. This is a local high school will be closed for the rest of this week because of the flu. The principal at Concordia High School in Pflugerville says 35 students were out today alone. and That's nearly 30 percent of the entire school. And that's on top of sick employees. Our Jacqueline Powell joining us not live now. And you spoke with the principal today. And what's their next step there? I did, Robert. I just spoke to him on the phone a little bit ago. He says the main priority right now is just getting this outbreak under control. So they've closed the school down for a little while to do some deep cleaning. School leaders say despite efforts to clean classrooms as best they could over the past few days, more and more students have caught the flu bug going around. So while the school shut down over the next few days, they'll bring in their entire custodial staff and deep clean all surfaces in the building. School leaders also plan to use disinfectant foggers, which are designed to clean the air. The hope is that deep cleaning, paired with time away, will get the school back on track. Education is just becoming hard in the classrooms with the number of students that are missing and what that means for backing up and reteaching. And, and so we felt it was probably in everybody's best interest to just take a break, give us a chance to kind of separate from each other, maybe let this bug work through um, our various families and get a fresh start next time. Well, for students and athletes, practices and games will still run as scheduled this week, but the school has canceled its winter formal that was set for Friday. It'll have to be rescheduled, and the school is set to reopen next Monday, but the school's board will decide whether these four days off will need to be made up. Robert? Thanks, Jacqueline. Nationwide, the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention says there is enough supply, but the skyrocketing demand has prompted some urgent care centers to scramble. The CDC tallies two-thirds of pregnant women have not gotten the flu shot yet.